Here's how to install the Kino Mod menu in less than two minutes. To open up your browser, download the Bepinex Mod Loader. The X64 file is the one you want to choose. Everything is linked in the description and comments. Download the latest version of the Kino Mod. The zip file is the one that you want to choose. Once it's downloaded, close it all down. You want to open up Steam. Then you want to right click on CarX, go to Manage and click on Browse Local Files. This is the best way to find your local game files of CarX. Close down Steam. Drag this to the left. Open up a new window. Go to your Downloads folder. Drag that to the right. Open up the BepinX zip folder. Highlight everything. Drag it over to the CarX game files. You can now close the zip folder. Open up the new BepinX folder. You'll find one folder called Core. You want to make a brand new folder. This one is called Plugins. Once you've made it, open it up. Now you want to open your Kino zip folder, highlight everything and drag it across. Now you can close everything down. We're on to the final steps. You want to open up Steam, right click CarX, go to properties and select the beta section. And how this works is basically if you want to use mods, select public moddable version, but you won't be able to play the top 32 drift tournament. If you want the normal version of the game that doesn't allow mods, but you want to play top 32, click none. And you can switch between both these versions. It saves your progress. Don't have to worry. Just choose the version you want and then load up CarX. And then we're on to the final step. Once CarX loads up, you want to press F4 on your keyboard. And this is going to bring up the Kino mod menu. There's loads of really cool features. I'm going to make another video on how to install custom modded maps using Kino how to install custom liveries and loads more. Subscribe so you don't miss those videos. I hope this helped you and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.